hello everyone today I will share to you about how to install the SCR CPY to your Linux especially Fedora it started when I was curious about how to remote my Android phone from my computer and then I browse to the internet and I found something that I can use this SCR CPY for remoting my Android from my computer. What is SCR CPY? Okay. Okay. What is SCR CPY? SCR CPY. Let's check from the github page so when i did browse the internet about this scrcpy the google showed to me that we can see this scrcpy in this github page and we can see this description this application provides display and control of an android devices connected via usb or over tcp ip in this tutorial we will just remote from the USB. It doesn't require any root access. It means that we don't need the root access in our Android. It works on Linux, Windows, and Mac OS. So, how to install? We can see in this section get the app in linux we can use the apt install scrcpy but i think it's for debian family and ubuntu for the fedora there's a package available in the copr so if you never heard before about the copr let's check this fedora magazine copr fedora magazine i used to read about this copr in fedora magazine hmm. which one maybe i will click this link so you can read copr is a build system for anyone in the fedora community it hosts thousands of projects for various purposes and audiences so the copr is like 
a repo that you can add to your Fedora. So how to enable this repo? Let's see the tutorial in Fedora magazine. How to enable the repo if you are using a version of Linux with DNF you can use this command and if you have older distribution you can use this command so because I use the Fedora 35 so I will use this DNF command yum is the package manager for Fedora before the DNF so DNF COPR enable and then followed by the project and for this SCRCPY there's a project let's click this So, for this SCRCPY, there's a project called Zinu slash SCRCPY. So, how, how to install, how to add this project to our Fedora? This is the command. Let's try. Before we try to install this SCRCPY, let's read this description. SCRCPY provides display and control, blah, 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 blah. You can read by yourself. And then, hmm, okay, this notes, I think it's important to us to know. The RPM Fusion external repositories are needed for pulling in FFMS2 as a build dependency. So we need to install the RPM Fusion repository first before we install this SCRCPY. So we will go to the RPM Fusion and enable this enable RPM Fusion on your system so I will just copy this command command line setup using RPM to enable access to both free and non-free repository use the use the following command okay Okay, everyone, sorry for my mistake. Actually, I already installed this RPM Fusion 
so if you want to install to enable the rpm fusion repository you can just copy this command into your terminal and execute that command let's check the Xenos SCPR COPR again okay this RPM fusion repository already installed and then we can continue to enable this project yes you can read enabling a copr repository please note that this repository is not part of the main distribution and the quality quality may vary okay repository successfully enabled let's check our available repositories dnf repo oh i forgot I will clean this screen first. Let's check the manual page of the DNF. We are searching how to see the available repository in our system. we can use this dnf repo list dnf repo list you can see that copr zeno s c r c p y already active we just execute the dnf search C R C P Y Okay we can see that S R C P Y is available for us to install so sudo dnf install C R C P Y execute Okay, just type yes. Type yes again. Yes, complete. So the SCRCPY already installed in our Fedora. Let's check. Is there any something new? SCR. Hmm. Wait. Wait. 
there's no scrcpy Okay, so I think there is no launcher for this SCRCPY. I think we need to execute a command like this. Okay, let's try. SCR CPY but first plug an Android device and execute so before you execute this command you need to plug in your Android okay I just already plug my Android into my Fedora so I will I will just execute this SCRCPY Wait, there's an error in here. ADP kill server. And I think there's a notification in my Android phone. Let me check first. Oh yeah, that's correct. There's a notification in my phone and I just click OK, the OK button. Let's see the result. Okay, everyone. I think it's connected now I can remote my Android from my Fedora okay so we already successful to remote our Android and I think this is the end of this video so don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel